This is the VOA Special English Agriculture Report. Investing in agricultural research and development can help poor countries fight hunger and poverty. A new study says investments in Sub-Saharan Africa increased by more than 20 percent between 2001 and 2008. But the study also found that just a few countries were responsible for most of that growth. Nigeria was responsible for one-third of it. Ghana, Tanzania, Sudan, and Uganda also increased their spending. But 13 countries decreased their investments. Nienka Bitma from the Washington-based International Food Policy Research Institute led the study. She says new technologies are needed to fight hunger. She says some countries, including Nigeria, have increased their investments after spending far too little in the past. She says it is a positive sign because it is more commitment from the government. But my Nigeria had extremely low levels of agricultural research funding. She was there for the first time in 2000 or 2001. She visited institutes that could not function, she says. They did not even have a phone line or fuel for their cars or a working computer. Nigeria now has the largest agricultural research system south of the Sahara. But Nyanka Bintma says a better measure of progress is whether a country is spending more than 1% of its agricultural money on research. And in 2008, she says Nigeria was not doing that. Botswana, Burundi, Kenya, Mauritania, and Mauritius were spending more than 1%. So were Namibia, South Africa, and Uganda. Ms. Bitma examined levels of financing and employment at 370 research centers in 32 countries. She believes most countries depend too heavily on international donations to help pay for research. Many donations are short-term, she says, and the research often ends when the money has been spent. Ms. Bintma says countries must improve their higher education systems to get more qualified researchers. But the study found that new researchers are not being hired in some countries because of budget problems. At the same time, many older researchers are nearing retirement age. Private industry may be able to help if governments cut their spending. Some cooperatives, for example, raise money for research into important crops. For VOA Special English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti. For more agricultural news and to learn English, go to voaspecialenglish.com.